somebody mentioned that the door for President Putin is closed in the free world. I would be happy to have the same closed door for myself. Everybody is talking to Putin. Everybody is meeting Putin. Everybody is in close touch with Putin. <coughs> so should, is there any kind of isolation, real strong isolation of President Putin? No. No. And the guy is, the guy is trying to play himself as a very masculine, very strong leader. And let's be frank. It's important not to underestimate the enemy. He is doing quite well. So he is attacking us. He is attacking you. He is humiliating the free world. He is humiliating the global leaders. And you guys absorb this? You are fine with this? So a concerted and strong actions are needed. Very strong actions. Sanctions. No doubt that sanctions are important. Just let me remind you that as far as I remember, in 2006, the world imposed sanctions on North Korea, right? And as far as I remember, today North Korea have ICBMs that can easily reach the mainland of the United States. Should we draw the lessons out of this? So it's important for us to realize that if we are united, if we are determined, if we stick to our values but not to the value, we can win. This is the only option we have on the table. We don't have anything else. To fight like hell for what we believe in and what is right in this world. And not to play any kind of tricks or to try to cut, cut any kind of backdoor deals or to find an excuse why not to support Ukraine. I can present you a plenty. But I can tell you one very important thing. Our success is your success. Our failure is your disaster. So you are not just fighting for us. You are fighting for yourself. 